Good morning, my friend. Good morning, grade seven. I hope that you have a wonderful time in Ramadan, and I hope you enjoy month of Ramadan by reading Quran and praying on the time. Don't late the pray. Pray the al-asr on, on, on its time and the Maghrib. Don't forget to do that, okay? So we will start our lesson of today. We continue the same lesson. We start that before the area of the circle. We said that Hatim, the area of the circle is equal what? The area of the circle equal by, by this by a Hatim times R squared. I have the rule of the area is equal what Hatim? The rule of the area is by R squared. Again, if I have that Hatim, I have the area of the circle. Look with me. The rule of the area of the circle, okay? This one is equal what? It will be by R squared. So the area of the circle is equal by R squared. This by Hatim. I will multiply by what? This by, I will multiply by R, 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 R. Okay? So the area of the circle is equal what? Okay, Hattan, welcome. Welcome, Hattan. Happy Ramadan. So the area of the circle is equal by R squared. So I will multiply this by, by the radius power 2. I will multiply this by, by the radius power 2. Okay? So, here, this one, in the first example, I have the radius is equal 7.1. This called by what had 10, this one is called by the radius. So the length of this one is called by the radius. Okay? If I need the area, what will make? We will multiply by R squared. Again, the rule is this by, you know this by like T have two legs. And this by Hatem is equal 3.14 or equal 22 over 7. This by had 10 is equal 3.14 or 22 over 7. Again, the area of the circle is equal what? I said that the area of the circle is equal 3.14 or 22 over 7. The area of the circle is equal this two number. We can replace with 3.14 at 10 or replace that with 22 over 7. I need you now to write the rule in the notebook. The rule of the area of the circle is by r squared or by r power 2, raised to power 2. You know that? Again, the area of the circle is equal what, Hatem? Again, write with me, please. By r squared or by r power 2. Okay? So, if I have that at 10, the radius is 7.1. What will make at 10? What will make? to find the area of this one. Look with me. If I need the area of the circle, we will make by R squared. So by R squared, I will make writing the rule and substitute it about R by 7.1. I will substitute it about R by 7.1. Okay? So I will make that happen. 3.14, this number, 3.14 times 7.1 power 2. 7.1 power 2, it means 7.1 times 7.1. If I will multiply them together, Hatem, this one is equal what? Look with me. If I need to multiply 3.14 times this number, look with me what we have. We have that, 3.14. 3.14. 3.14 times this number, 7.1 power 2. 7.1 power 2. This one equal what you had equal 158, 158.28. Write with me. Again, you had We will write the rule. Write firstly the rule. The area of the circle by R squared. The area of the circle is by R squared. And the radius here is 7.1. So 3.14 times 7.1 bar 2. Again, you had We will write. 3.14 times 7.1 power 2. It equals 158.28. 8 here is greater than 5. So I add 1. It will be equals 158.3. It will be 158.3. Is it clear, Hatem? Uh, yes. Hatem. You understand this? Yes. Okay. Can you tell me 
What is the name of this one, Hatem? This line, the line segment joining between these two points? It's called by? Its name is what? The name of this line segment. We said this one is called by the yeah. radius. This one, do you know Damn the it. name of this? Diameter. So this okay. one is diameter, okay? This one is diameter. So here we have radius, and this one is diameter. Again, this line segment is what happened? Damage. Damage. Again, my friend, if he gives me this line segment, the short one, can you see the mouse moving here? So this one is radius. The line segment had them joining between these two points is called by radius. But this one, we call it by what? This one, we call it by diameter. If he gives me the diameter had him, I must divide it by two. Again, if he gives me the diameter, I must divide it by two. Again, here, if we have the diameter, I must divide it by two. So firstly, hat, I will divide it 12 over two. I will divide it 12 over two equals what hat him? Six. I will divide it 12 over two. 12 divided six. by two is equal six. Clear hat him? So the first step, I will find the radius. Divided the diameter over 2. So firstly, I will divide the diameter over 2. So 12 divided by 2 hat equals 6. After that, I will write the rule. The area of the circle equal what? This by hat. This by, like T have two legs, which equal to 22 over 7. Or 3.14. Again, by is equal what? 22 over 7, this one. Or 3.14. Again, by is equal what Hatem? 22 over 7 or, or 3 by 14. 14. So the value of the by is equal what Hatem? 22 over 7 or 3 by 14. So this 12, I will divide it by 2 firstly. This 12, I will divide it by 2. Equals what Hatem? Equals 6. This 6 Hatem, I will make it bar 2 because I have the radius bar 2. So 6 bar 2. And I will multiply that by 3.14. So we'll multiply what happened? 3.14 by 6 bar 2. Again, the result is will be what? The result is 3.14 times 6 bar 2. 3.14 times 6 bar 2, or raised to bar 2, or squared, equals what happened? 113.04. It's equal 113.04. Again, hat. if he gives me the diameter, if he gives me the diameter, it's 12. The first step divided by 2. The first step, we will divide it here by 2. So the first step, Hatim, we will divide it, this one over 2. 12 divided by 2, Hatim, equals 6. 12 divided by 2 equals what? Equals 6. So the radius here is equal 6. After that, I need the area of the circle. I will multiply this by. We call this symbol by by. This T have two legs, or 11 by dash. It's called by by hat. I will remove by and put 22 over 7, or 3.14. Again, we will put what? 22 over 7, or 3.14. So we'll multiply by, or 22 over 7, or 3.14, by 6 bar 2. It will be equal, it's equal, 6 bar 2 times 3.14, 113.04 is equal what? 113.04. If I make approximation, is equal 113. Can you tell me, Hatton, how I can find this, uh, the area of this one? If I have the diameter is one hundred uh, equal 13 kilometer at yes can you have, if i have the diameter is 13 kilometer here so the radius mm -hmm. is equal what height here Over this is the diameter yes divided by two so the first okay. step had it, i will divide it here by two again the first step had them i will divide it by two 13 divided by two equals what Thirteen divided by two equals. Hmm? 
right? 6.5. 6.5, right? Again, yes. this one is 6.5 or 6.5. Here I need the area. We will write what? We will write what? We will write by Five. R squared. The formula, the rule of the area of the circle is by R squared. The, head. the area of the circle is by R squared. And the radius is 6.5. So we'll write 3.14 times what? 6.5 power 2. 3.14 times 6.5 power 2. It equals what? If you do that over your calculator, Hatton. 132.5. 665. Again, this one is equal what? This one is equal 132.665. If I need to make approximation or rounding to one decimal only, so I have the right six is bigger than five. The right six is greater than five. So I will cancel that and add one. So it will be it's equal. 132.7. It equals 132.7. Is it clear, Hatem? Yes. Do you understand? Yes. Okay. Can you help me to solve the next, please? Example number four. Tell me first, what is this? This is radius or diameter? Radius. This small part. This is radius, right? So I don't yes. divide it by two. If I have a radius, Hatem, I don't divide it by two. If I have a radius, I don't divide it by two. If I have a diameter only, I will divide it by two, right? Yeah. So here the radius is equal four inch. Four inches, okay? Here Hatton, if it gives me by is equal four. What is the rule? What is the formula here for the area of the circle? Divide four. By R squared, right? Yeah. So by R squared, the area here is equal by R squared. The area is equal by R squared, right? Yeah. By, I put that by 3.14. Do you remember? I said that by is equal 3.14 or 22 over 7. I will put by here by 3.14. So we'll write what happened. 3.14 times 4 squared times 4 squared, right? We will not Can you uh, find divide it by 2. No, I don't divide it by two. When I divide it by two, I have to, if he gives me the diameter, if he gives me the diameter, I will divide it by two. Have to. If he gives me the diameter, have to, I will divide it by two. Okay? Here, I have the diameter. In this example, no. I have four is the radius. I don't divide it by two. If I have the radius, I don't divide it by two. Have to. If I have the radius, I don't divide it by two. Okay? So the radius as it is, 4. I make the formula by R squared. By R squared. By R raised to power 2. By, by 3.14 times the radius is 4, power 2. Right? 3.14 times 4 power 2 equals what? Do you, do you solve it, Hatton? 3.14 times 4 squared? Hatton, do you finish? Do you finish, Hatton? Okay, I will write 3.14 Hatton times 4 bar 2. It means times 16, my friend. 3.14 times 16 is equal what Hatton? 50.24. The result is 50.24. 4 here Hatton is less than 5. 4 is less than 5. So I will cancel this 4 and write the number 50.2. I will cancel this 2. And I will write this four canceled, and I will write the number 50.2. Hatton, 
tell me, what is the name of this sign segment? I said, this one is radius. This one is called by what? Diameter. What? Diameter. So the small one here, Hatim, is called by the radius. This one is called by the radius. This one, I call it by diameter, okay? If you have the diameter, Hatim, what we do firstly? Diameter divided by two, right? If you have the diameter, remember, diameter started by D, right? So divided by two yeah. started by D. You have diameter divided by two. If you have diameter, what we do, Hatim? We divide it by two, right? So if I divided 42 Hatton divided by 2 is equal what? What? If you have the diameter is 42 and I divided this number over 2, 42 divided by 2 equals what? Uh, 21. 21. So the result of this one, 21, right? The radius is equal 21. If the diameter is 42, so the radius here is only is equal what? 21. The radius is equal 21. Okay? The radius is equal what you had in 21. This one. Okay? Yeah. So, what is the formula? Do you remember the formula of the area, the rule? No. We said that Hatem, it's by R squared. Again, repeat with me, Hatem, please. What is the area of the circle? By R squared or by R power 2. Again, the area of the circle is equal what, Hatem? By R squared. Or? By R. by R power 2, right? Again, I need to listen to you. By R. Hmm. Squared or by R? Or two. Again, has again. What is the area of the circle? We said that before. By r squared or by r power two. Again, the area of the circle. Repeat with me, please. By r, r squared. By r, by r squared or by r power two. Right? Yes. So, by here is twenty-two over seven. Why I use this number? Because 21 is multiple of 7. 21 Hatem is multiple of 7. Okay? Can you do this one, please, for me? Solve this one. Okay? I give you two minutes to solve this one. And number give me six. Number 5. We are in number 5. We divided 42 over 2 Hatem. 42 divided by 2 Hatem is equal what? 42 divided by 2 is equal 21. Okay? And after that, we will use the rule. We'll use the rule by r squared by, I will replace it with 22 over 7, and r by 21, okay? Try to solve this one, please. Hatem, are you here? Yes, six, uh, sixty-one. Look with me. What we have to do, Hatem, here? Look with what? me, please. We will write the rule firstly, Hatem. We will write the rule by this way. The area of the circle is by r squared. Can you see this? The area of the circle is equal what by r squared by this way, Hatem. So we will write the rule firstly. The area of the circle, area equal by R squared. 
Can you see that? Yes. Okay. Look with the video what we will do now. We will remove by Hatem and replace it with 22 over 7. I will remove this number and put 22 over 7 here. So the first step, Hatem, I will remove by and replace this one by 22 over 7. After that, we will multiply this one by the radius squared. What is the radius squared here, Hatem? Is 42 divided by 2 is equal 21. I will put for this 21 power 2 or raise this one to power 2. Can you do this one with the calculator now? I will multiply 22 over 7 times 21 squared hat. Again, we will multiply 22 over 7 times what? 22 over 7 here, multiply by 21 raised to power 2 or squared. This one is equal what hat? Hatem, are you here? Hatem, calculate this one for me, please. I will multiply 22 over 7 wait, times Mr. this one. Wait, Mr. Sarah will become. So if we will try to make this one to 21, OK? times 7, this 21 is raised to power 2 is, is would be squared. So it means 21 times 21. If I multiply the number by itself, it will be, it's equal to the number squared. So I make the number squared, it means power 2. After that, we will calculate this result by using the calculator. The using of the calculator here gives me the number is what? The answer here is what? Look, I multiply. 22 over 7 times 7 squared. So if you will multiply these two together, again, I will multiply what? Fraction 22 over 7. The down, I will have 7. And after that, I will multiply this one by 21 squared. Look with me, the answer is this number. If you look into this answer, you can see that the answer here is 22 over 7 times 21 squared. So the result here is 130, 1,386. Again, the answer here is what? The answer here is 1,386, OK? So here we said that, we said what? If we need to multiply this one, we will multiply these two together, 22 over 7 times 21 squared the result is equal 1386 we will go now to the next example the next example said for us i have the diameter is equal 5.6 the diameter is equal 5.6 if the diameter look with me the diameter is equal 5.6 i can't working with this number again hatem if he gives me that i have the diameter is equal what the diameter is equal 5.6 I can't working with this number Hatem. So what we will do here, we will make that divided the number over two Salih Rumayan. So we will divide this number five over uh, five point six divided this number over two. So the radius here is equal what five point six divided by two. Again, if he gives me the radius by this way, if he gives me the radius is five point six. Uh, the diameter, I need the radius. I will divide this number over two. So divided 5.6 divided by two, it equals 2.8. 5.6 divided by two is equal 2.8. Again, Hatem, what we do? We will divide it. Salih al Rumayan, the diameter over two. If you need the radius, you must keep that in your mind. Radius is equal, diameter divided by two. Again, the radius is equal what? The radius here is equal, diameter divided by two. So I will divide it. 5.8 divided by uh, 5.6 divided by 2. 5.6 divided by 2 it gives me 2.8. After that, the area of the circle, the area of circle is equal to what? The area of the circle is equal by r squared. The area of the circle is equal by r squared. Again, the area of the circle is equal what Salah Roman is equal that hatem by r squared by r squared it means by times r times r so we will remove by and put 22 Mr. over what's 7. Its, what's its name 
What is its name? This is called by area of the circle. Area of the circle. And this symbol is called by by. Do you know that? By? Yes. Like you said for someone, uh, bye bye. If you go home or something like this. So by here is will be that is 22 over 7 or maybe equal 3.14. By here is equal 22 over 7 or equal 3.14. Okay? Can you see this symbol? After that, we will remove R and put what 2.8. I will put R by 2.8 bar 2 or 2 by 0.8 squared. After that, you will bring your calculator by this way. Look with me. I bring my calculator with me, and I will start to write. Look with me what we will write. We will write fraction by this shape. Can you see it? I will write fraction yes. in 22 over what? This one over 7. This one is equal 22 over 7. After that, we will go in the side. Times what? Times the rate. The radius is 2.8. And we'll make power 2 by click over this button. The answer now, Hatim, is equal to what? Can you see the answer? Is 24.64. 24.64. Yes. What is the value of 24.64 here? The value of this one is equal 24.64. So 4 here is less than 5. Can you see this 4? Yes. This 4 is less than 5. Solid. So I will cancel this number and I will write it 24.6. This answer is what? 24.6. Okay? Yes. Can we go to another example? Yes. Okay? Look with me. We will go to the next. Number 7. Look with me. We go now to number 7. He gives me the diameter. The diameter. Is equal what, Salih Rumayan? The diameter here is equal 9.4, right? Yes. The diameter here, what? 9.4. And I said for you, if he gives me the diameter, I must divide it. Hatem over 2. The radius, I need the radius. Again, if he gives me the diameter, the diameter like this one, can you see this one is the diameter? I need only the radius like this. So I divide it by 2. If he gives me the diameter uh, at 10, what? Uh, Salah Rumayan, what we will make? I will divide that over 2, right? So the radius here, Salah, is equal what, my friend? 9.4 divided this one over 2. Salah, can you tell me 9.4 divided by 2 gives me what? It equals what? 9.4. Do it mentally. It's very easy. 9.4. If you have 9.4 real and you need to divide it over 2, if you have a piece of cloth, this one is, will be, uh, its length is 9.4 meter, and I need to divide it into two pieces. Each piece is equal what? 9.4 divided by 2, right? 4.2. 9 divided by that, 4.7. It's equal 4.7. Why? 9 divided by 2 equals 4. And the remainder is 1. 14 divided by 2 equals what, Saleh? 4.7 by this shape. Okay? So the radius here is equal what, Saleh? 4.7. The radius is equal what? 4.7. After that, what we will make happen? We will write the rule of the area. The area of circle. The area of circle. Or we can draw a circle by this shape. Equals what, Hatem? Look with me. The area of the circle equal by R squared. The area of the circle is equal what, Hatem? By R squared. By R raised to power 2. Okay? So the area of the circle is equal by R squared or by R power 2. So we will write by by 3.14. I will write by by 3.14. And after that, we will multiply this one by R. R here, the radius is equal what? Hatem. The radius is equal, Salih Rumayan, 4.7. 4.7, and we will put power 2. We will make this one is a square. Power 2 or a square. Bring your calculator like this. 
and clear what you write before. And we will write the same fraction. Can you see that, Saleh? Yes. And write up 22 and go down to write what? Seven? It's equal 22 over seven, Saleh? Yes. And after that, go to the side and make multiply 4.7 squared. Here I have the answer. The answer is what, Saleh? The answer here is equal 69.42. Two here, this number. Can you see this number two? Yes. Is less than five. Two here is less than five. Okay? Two here is less yes. than five. What we'll make? We will cancel this two and write the number four only. So we'll cancel this and write the number how, Saleh? 69.4. Is it clear? Yes. Help me to solving number eight. I need someone help me to solving number eight now. Who can help me to solving number eight? Saleh or Hatim? Go, Saleh, please. Can you help me? Hmm. Tell yes. me, Saleh. What is the given here? He gives me the radius, right? The radius is equal what, Saleh? The radius is equal what? Three and a half. Three and a half, I can write it 3.5. So the radius here is equal what, Saleh? 3.5. Again, the radius is equal what? 3.5. So if he gives me the radius is 3.5, what we will do? We will write the area of the circle. Area of circle, my friend. This is the area of the yes. circle. Area of the circle is equal what? By r squared. The area of the circle is equal what, Saleh? By r squared. Again, the by area of the circle is equal by r squared. This is the area of the circle. Again, what is the area of the circle, my friend? By r squared. Again, the area of the circle is equal what? By r squared. By right? r squared. By yeah. here, I will write it what? 22 over 7. By here is equal 22 over 7. And the radius is 3.5, right? We will yes. put over 3.5 here, Hatem, power 2. It means a squared, right? Again, the area yes. is equal what? Talih. By R squared.